Hey guys, I'm LB, and I didn't actually know that you could do this on these screens. That's cool looking. Anyway, we're gonna play Fahrenheit by K7 Avenger. Fahrenheit is a large puzzle featuring a single laser that has multiple uses. Enjoy. And Nock has added to their favorites. But yeah, this is cool. I didn't actually know this was possible. I guess it makes sense, since, you know, you can use any- any movie, any BIK file you want, really. Neat. Alright, let's continue on with the map, in that case. Interesting, we have a window into the rest of the map. Well, this is an interesting music choice. Wow, this is, uh... A lot bigger than I expected. Wait, we can come back up? Why do we have the ability to come back up here? That's... mighty suspicious. I don't think we can go back up there unless we get bounce shell, but... This is kinda suspicious. Can we see anything from over here? I don't think we could. Well anyway, wow, this is a- this is a... There is a lot more map here than I expected. Wow. That's death. Definitely death. A lot of graded portal surfaces. Wow. Well, that did something. Square. Huh. I was not expecting this much grading, to be perfectly clear. Thankfully, we can see through it for the most part. If you have your anti-aliasing setting on the wrong setting for your graphics card, uh, the grading becomes almost impossible to see through. Like, some people wouldn't be able to see that cube dropper over there at all. It just depends on your anti-aliasing setting. Which is, uh, I think... I think it's right about here. This is the one you want to change. Just keep changing it until you can see through grading properly. I think some people say that the highest setting doesn't necessarily make... the make it easiest to see through sometimes. Actually, where do I need to go? I'm a bit confused on that regard. I don't... I don't see... What turns this off? I don't- can't- I can't see the signage. Is the signage on this side? Okay, so there's stuff over there that does that, then. Right. Oh, there's also this I didn't notice. Wow, I bent the laser. It's, uh... There we go. That's much better. <laughs> hmm. So if I jump here... And then... Allows me to get over here like this. Right. Then what? Then what indeed? I can shoot. I can see that from here. Can't see that, right? There's a random fizzler there. What am I even doing right now? I'm a bit confused. ...on the concept. So I could see this from the very beginning, which is interesting. And now I can't get back in there without doing a whole laser rigmarole. Can't see that. Yeah, that's behind glass. What am I doing? What in the world am I doing? What is up here? Anything? Oh, a whole bunch of stuff. Hold on a sec. I didn't even know that was connected like that, but sure. So that turns off that fizzler, but I don't even know what that does. So... yeah. Well, there's also that, which I didn't notice. Hmm... I wonder... Can I even see that from over here? Oh, I can! Am I supposed to, though? Uh, let's try it. Ouch! Normally, that would kill you in real life. If you had portals in real life, of course. Ah, it's interesting looking. So that drops a cube on our head, and this is just X. 
Gotcha. What is this for? Maybe it launch- maybe- maybe it's an angled panel that will launch us- Whee! Like that? Or something? That'd be my guess. Hmm... What else is around here? Not much, honestly. There's this area. I don't even know where to go first. Let's just save here. And go over here. And if we don't like it, we can go back. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, that- oh. Interesting, that- that turns off a whole bunch of other stuff as well. Alright, fine, there's not- nothing much to do over here just yet. Gotcha. So let's head over in this direction instead. Ouch! My head! I scooped my hair on that. Oh well, it's easy enough to try again. Ouch! <laughs> I think I actually do have to do this this way. Oops, that is not quite what I meant to do. Um... There. Hey, that works. Sure. What is this area for? There's not a Sendificator in this map. Is there? Well, we wouldn't, we wouldn't have a t custom tag, right? Can you make custom tags that Valve didn't make? Oh, this is X. Ooh... Okay, then. Can I actually do that from here? No, I can't. Or can I? Oh, actually, I think I can. Um... Wait, which one is X? The lower one. Aha! That's something. That is most definitely something. Um... Well, there's where that comes into play. Interesting. Ooh! I don't even know what that's connected to. Don't mind if I check real quick. Oh, that's connected to the exit. Okay, so that's an exit condition, don't have to wear- oh crap. I hit something. Oh, I hit that. Well... It's easy enough to fix that problem. Here, I'll just do this to save time, because I'm impatient. I am an impatient human being. There we go. Right, so we're back here, this is where I saved. I can jump to here, although I'm not really sure why I would want to. I can't get over to there without square. Does that do square? No. Something does square, and I don't remember what it is now. I saw a square around here somewhere, didn't I? No. I thought I swear. Oh, that's square! Okay, right. I have to. The thing is, you, you can't even see it from here, so. Yeah, that's a bit of an issue, isn't it? So, we have to do that. We have to actually remember that it's even there in the first place. There we go. Yeah, we had to actually remember that it even existed. I'm not too much a fan of that map design, so I can understand why K7 Adventure prefers newer maps. And this is permanent, I'm assuming. Exit condition. That's all we needed to do, except for... Right... Oh, so we have to redo all that, because I didn't spawn the cube first. Oops. Right. Why is this... so annoying to redo this part? Like, I have to move over to around the glass here, and then I have to do... Uh... How high do I need this? I don't- I don't know. Let's just go right there. There we go. That dropped the cube. And then I have to go back and do... This. And, uh, actually, I guess I could just portal myself up there, couldn't I? Alright, never mind. I can just portal myself up there. Come here, cube. Alright, we got a cube now. What 
might we want to do with that information? Hmm. I think we should start by doing this. And I'll just leave it right about there. We'll run all the way over here. There we go. So that's done that. <laughs> ah, sorry, I'm allergic to whatever is on that weighted storage cube. It's coated in some sort of weird dustiness. Right. We do that. And this, we should be able... to theoretically... progress. Wee! Yep, right through the physics exactly as I predicted. See, I've played maps before. I know what I'm doing sometimes. Hmm. You can see this from here at least. So that's something. Right, but we need the cube as well. Why though? What am I even trying to accomplish here? What is that? Oh, that's a light strip! <laughs> well, I guess now that I have a portal up here, I could just jump for it. Like, this is clearly here for that reason, but I mean... Is there a reason to make the jump so deadly and so risky? Like, it almost feels unintended in ways. I feel like there's a lot of unnecessary jumps in this map. Right, so let's take this up here. And then figure out why I did that in the first place. Right, that's a thing that's been done. You can easily bring the cube back down there if need be from this save point. What have I even accomplished, though? Why did I do this? Why is this a thing I have done? I literally don't see the benefit of this. put a portal there without going through the whole rigmarole again if I lose a portal over here. Oops. Pretty sure I could, like, jump shoot the portal and land back on here if I try hard enough. What is even happening in this map? I'm so confused. <laughs> Why did I do the thing that I did? And that's not helpful. Those also graded? Those are also graded. I... really don't know what to do anymore. Cause like, if I move my portal away from here, I'm gonna lose the queue, basically. What did I even need it to do? 
And I definitely needed the laser. There's not another laser, right? I don't see any other laser that I could be missing somehow. And, like, I can't walk in here, shoot a portal somewhere, and then walk back out because this this will just turn back on instantaneously when the laser disconnects. Why... did I do this? Also, could I have done that from the very beginning with this? I'm gonna get this cube back in here. You know what? You know what? I need to go back. I don't know what this is for, I don't think I'll ever know. Oh, this is the way I have to get back in. Cause I don't have any other way to get back in there, right? Well, that's a problem. Okay, cause I can't walk out of this portal surface. And I can't see any other portal surfaces around here to, to ham help. Hmm. Maybe now that I've done that, I don't have to worry so much? That's my guess. I think that this is what I needed, because now I can walk up to get the cube, right? Supposedly? Yeah, I think that's what I can do. Uh, excuse me. There we go. So if I do this... ...and then... I ...need to shoot the upper half, and then quickly shoot that... That respawned the cube, I believe. can I see from here? I want to be able to see that at some point. I'm not sure how, though. I suppose I could go back around- yeah, now that I got the cube in here. Okay, so I just need to get the cube in here. Yeah, okay, now things are making sense. I was stuck there for a moment because I couldn't figure out how- how turning that off was helpful. But then I realized I had no other way to get back in here other than that. Right, so, now I just leave the cube here. I think that should be fine. And... Right, 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 right. N wrong spot. Jump there. Portal. Uh, can we center it a bit better, please? Thank you. Do that. And then do... that. <sighs> right. Where? Hmm. I'm gonna need a lot of velocity, aren't I? Hmm. Well, let's just figure this out, I guess, for the moment. And go from there? Because there's no grading... Yeah, so this is where we actually have to get up there. Right? I want the cube up there first, I think. So... I'll put this in a convenient spot. There we go. There we go. That worked out. That worked out just fine. Theoretically... Oh, I can't. Ooh. So I have to walk downstairs. Okay, yeah, so this is... this is fine. I can do that. And then... Then what? Can't shoot that from here. What about... No, because there's glass in the way. Hmm. Alright! That's what this is for. So I can shoot that. Okay. I'm not sure how much of a puzzle this was. I mean, I guess it was kind of puzzly? But a lot of it just felt like unnecessary jumping and... I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about this one. I'll, I'll write it up, but it's kind of a weird map in my opinion. Walking around shooting lasers? I don't know. Yeah, I'll write it up because I got stuck at this part, but... 
I don't know. It's a weird nap. <laughs> right, well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!